Well, Wardy, it's a, a defeat here this evening against Forest Green Rovers. Just get your overall thoughts on that 90 minutes to start, please. Uh, I think probably uh, two really different performances. First first half, couldn't get the grips with it and probably looked like there was more on it for them. They looked like they wanted it more, to be honest. Uh, so, you know, that was disappointing from our, t our point of view because we, we approached the game right, we've done everything right and, and, and wanted to keep the momentum going that we've built over the last couple of weeks. So it was a disappointing disappointing start. Um, the second half we were much better, um, but in the end we were probably beaten by, uh, you, you know, our first half performance really. And there was a number of changes made for, for both sides, but it was just those fine margins that really separated both sides at the end of the day, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. I think we started well and then, you know, I think they, they probably got their goal against the runner play a little bit. We're, we're disappointed with that. And then well, yeah, if goals change games, they, they you know, started, started to get control, a bit more control in the game, which was disappointing from our point of view. And um, yeah, I think first half, you know, was probably summed up that with the goal that we conceded, it was disappointing. And, and just then after that, they looked like, you know, they, they wanted a bit more than us. So at half time, we were disappointed with that. We needed a reaction second half, and I thought there was that. I thought we, we, we got in their faces a lot more, won the ball a lot higher. Um, and we're disappointed we, we didn't create a little bit more to get back in the game. But I think all in all over, you know, the last, you know, the three games that we've played, we, we, we've been worthy of going through. and. Uh, I think with the run we've, we've, we've been on, um, you know, maybe there's a bit of fatigue after that, but we have to regroup and go again Saturday. We, you know, we've got a massive game here, which is good. You know, I've done a lot of travelling over the last few weeks, a lot of tough away games. So, you know, we're looking forward to getting back in front of the home fans this Saturday and hopefully putting on a, a, a real performance and getting three points again. You mentioned that run. It was eight games unbeaten coming yeah. into this one, and that's no mean feat across any competition, really. But this side have shown when they have lost a game that they can certainly come back and bounce back. It's all about doing that, like you say, on Saturday against Harrogate. 100%, and that's exactly what the gaffer said. You know, he wants everyone in tomorrow, smiles in their faces. You know, we parked this one now. We, we, we speak about the, we spoke about the game after where we, you know, what we, what we were disappointed with and what, what we've done okay. Um, so, you know, we park it now. We're, like I said, we're through to the next round and we've got a massive game on Saturday. So we've got to come in ready for that. We've got to recover. We've got to come in with the, the spirit we've had over the last few weeks has been, you know, no, brilliant it's it's been really enjoyable the games that we've been getting results in and we need to continue that form because our, our aim as well is to get up this table and, and, and get as close to that top two and then play off as, as quick as possible and this team know all about winning they've clearly got a taste for that you know unbeaten streak and it's all about now like you say putting that right and it's a good habit to have isn't it yeah it is and I think you know what's good about tonight is yeah we're disappointed we lost you know thankfully the consequ there was no consequence for us in, in losing the game in terms of not qualifying um you know we're obviously disappointed we didn't win the group but you know we, we've qualified and, and now it's about getting back to, to continuing our form in the league because we've had some really long trips some some tough games away from home as well and um, i think think we've acquitted ourselves really well we're really pleased with our form and um, we're really looking forward to getting back in front of the crowd here because you know we know we know they can be brilliant behind us and, and really get behind us and you know on Saturday we're looking forward to a good atmosphere and, and you know you know putting on a performance hopefully taking three points because we're, we're on a good good run of form at the minute especially in the league uh, and on a final note you mentioned the support just over 1700 here again it's a another really good you know boost for the side to show that they are being really well supported yeah we felt that all season and I think you know <clears throat> that they stayed with us in the, in the tough times at the start we hope we're you know, giving them something back with the recent performances and the recent run results. And yeah, well, listen, it's, it's been brilliant. The atmosphere is great around the club. There's a, a real togetherness at the minute between the fans. I think the, the, the players, the, the, the staff, everyone seems to be coming together and hopefully they can see that we're working tremendously hard and, and, and trying to do the right things to get up that league. So uh, looking forward to Saturday now, definitely.